James the Red Engine and the Troublesome Trucks, written by the Reverend W. Audrey and narrated by me, Daniel Solano. James had been shut in the shed for several days. He was sorry now that he had been naughty. At last, the back controller came. I want you to pull some trucks, he said. James went happily to find them. Here are your trucks, said the little tank engine. Come on, come on, puffed James. Ow, 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 screamed the trucks. You can't pull us. You can't. You won't. I can and I will. I can and I will, puffed James. Slowly but surely, he pulled them along the line. He saw Gordon's Hill ahead. Look out for trouble, warned his driver. He put on full steam, and soon they were halfway up. I'm doing it, I'm doing it, panted James. He felt a sudden jerk, and it seemed easier. I've done it, hurrah, he thought. But his driver stopped the train. We've left our tail behind, he said. The coupling has snapped, and the trucks were running down the hill. But the guard was brave and stopped them. Then he walked down the line to halt Edward's train with his red flag. James backed down and coupled up. What silly things trucks are, he thought. There might have been an accident. Shall I help you? asked Edward. No, thank you, answered James. I must pull them myself. Beep, beep, good luck, whistled Edward as James puffed away. I've done it, I've done it. He puffed in triumph as he climbed the hill and reached the station safely. The fat controller was pleased with him. You've made the most troublesome trucks on the line behave, he said. Well done, James. <laughs>